and Gunner. Today happens to be November 11th, Remembrance Day. So if you haven't yet, please uh, take some time and remember those who made the ultimate sacrifice for us to be where we are today. Today we're going to talk about the IPSC and USPSA scoring method, which includes accuracy, power, and speed. And I want to be able to explain this in real time, so what we managed to do was gather four shooters and we did a one stage match. So the first thing that affects the score is power factor. There are two types, minor, and major. For minor, Alpha would be worth 5 points, Charlie would be worth 3 points, Delta would be worth 1 point. For USPSA, the Bravo is uh, the same value. For major, Alpha is worth 5 points, Bravo and Charlie are worth 4 points, and Delta is 1 point. Mics are worth negative 10 points, and that spans across both minor and major. So let's break this scoring down. 16 alpha. So with me shooting minor, I have five points each. So 16 times five is 80. And then two Charlie. So three times two, three points times two is six. However, when I have the two mics, that brings me down negative 10 points each, so negative 20, which gives me a final score of 66. Now the power factor with my points correlates with the time. So 66 points divided by 28.3 gives me a power factor of 2.33. Range is clear. Time 28 30. 30. 28 30. Are you ready? Stand by. Now for Steve, he's also shooting minor, so 15 alpha is 75 points. For Charlie, is 12 points. And then one delta is one point. And fortunately, he has no mics. So that leaves him with a total of 88 points. So 88 divided by 32.06, uh, which is his time, gives him a hit factor of 2.74. Now this shooter, Taylor, is shooting in major. So that means alpha is worth five points, Bravo and Charlie are worth four points, and Delta is worth two points. So with six Alpha gives him 30 points, Charlie, uh, nine Charlie give him 36, three Delta give him six points, and then the two Mikes uh, give him negative 20 points with a total of 52 points. So 52 divided by 16.19 gives him a hit factor of 3.21. Are you ready? So this Stand shooter, by. Jun, is shooting minor, and he got 15 alpha for 75 points, 5 Charlie for 15 points, giving him a total of 90 points. So 90 divided by his total time, 26.98 gave him a hit factor of 3.34. If finished, unload, show clear. If clear, slide forward, hammer down, holster. Range is clear, safe. Time, 26.98. So the shooter with the highest hit factor was June with 3.34. Now, with the highest hit factor in the stage, he gets every point for that stage. The actual points don't matter anymore. And then everybody else gets a percentage of those points based on their hit factor 
compared to the uh, the winner's hit factor. So with June with a hundred a hundred points uh, as the highest, Taylor comes in second with ninety six points, and then Steve with eighty two points, and then myself with seventy points. Wah wah. So we are all compared to the top shooter, and then we just get the portion of the points for that stage. Thanks for watching this episode of The Canadian Gunner. If you want to see more videos, you can subscribe at The Canadian Gunner on YouTube. And we'll see you next time.